The Wichita Wind Surge wants its fans to know the team isn't going anywhere. An article in a Georgia newspaper listed the surge as one team being considered for relocation to Georgia. But the surge calls that report wrong. Cakes Abby Ray is live at Riverfront Stadium tonight with what she knows, Abby. Yes, it's been a busy day for wind surge officials as they've worked hard to dispel this claim and reassure Wichitans there's nothing to worry about in regards to local baseball. I feel like baseball in Wichita has been a big staple. I mean, at least since I was a kid, you know, with the Wranglers and things like that. And I feel like it kind of be doing Wichita discredit if we didn't have a local team of some sort. Luckily for baseball loving Wichitans, the wind surge is here to stay. But many folks were concerned after reading initial reports claiming the wind surge was one of five minor league teams being considered for relocation to Columbus, Georgia. Let's just hope that uh, that their numbers have been good and that they do not choose to move the wind surge out of Wichita. Hatman Jacks is one local business in the Delano district that has benefited from the recent Riverfront Stadium upgrades and baseball games throughout the summer. The wind surge crowds have been great for Delano. We've had a lot of people come up and down the block after work and before. It's been a blessing. And they aren't the only local business that would have strong feelings if the wind surge were to relocate. I'd be disappointed. I'd be disappointed because of how much time and effort they put into building the facilities over there and because of how it, it positively affects business in the area. The wind surge tells Cake it's happy here in Wichita and there's no reason to be concerned about false claims of relocation. Diamond Baseball Holdings, the owners of the Wichita wind surge and 28 other minor league teams, is expected to release a statement later this evening, further dispelling the rumors around town. The Wichita wind surge even posted earlier today that they're looking forward to another opening day in Wichita in just over 100 days. Live at Riverfront Stadium, Abby Ray, Cake News on your side.